Good morning, everybody. Good morning, all the squeaky belts and grandmas out there. Today is October 17th or 18th, I think. It's quiet house with the nieces, nephews, and my brother and Amy gone. No baby smiles or twins today. I did have some sales this morning. I'll cut to the sales. Sold a case only of Final Fantasy VII for $13. It's a case, there's no games. And there is a crack in the case as well. And I also sold an old Cybershot pink for 35 bucks. I don't know exactly what these are called. Map jackets? I've sold a couple of them. They have maps on the inside of World War II. Uh, this is the Normandy invasion. It's like a battle map and it's leather. It's sold for $85. I have sold these, they're not fast sellers. Long tail, finally sold. And now I'm on my way to drop those off at the post office because I missed my postman today. I'll probably be leaving Sunday or if Monday on my way north and then west. Um, right now I'm looking for, I'm gonna go to a couple thrifts, look for Amazon FBA inventory. Also, some sort of nightstand to create a platform to raise up a piece of plywood back there so I can store bins underneath rather than just sleeping on the carpet. That's like my vision is like two nightstands or like coffee tables that are the same height, uh, drill down a piece of plywood, super ghetto, and then sleep on top of that instead of the carpet. The higher off the ground I am, the more vertical space I have, the better. First thrift, the Humane Society. Parking next to a Tesla, because we can. We got a toner, 10 bucks. No brainer, 70 on Amazon, we're good. One of the easiest things to buy and sell is a toner cartridge. And this is a brand spanking new one. How do I know that? Experience and tape seals. This is the original tape. This thing has never been opened. It is a high yield TN460 by Brother. A very common size. Cheapest on Amazon is $85. I'm in it for 10. Easy money. Thrift store number two, hopefully gonna be better or as good as thrift store number one. $5.99, love these guys. Cord looks good. And then this is awesome. This is a gaming keyboard. You can tell by like all the all the cords coming off of it. It's really heavy. And this particular model is not made any. This one is restricted on Amazon, but it goes for about 100 on eBay. So we will grab this as well. Not bad at that Goodwill. Uh, I really wish I was unrestricted to sell this on Amazon. The cheapest FBA price is for a new one but it is $500. So this being used, I probably could easily get 100 to 154 on Amazon. I'm gonna shoot for 120 on eBay, take it home, test it. This is a, like all these weird nerdy switches over here. It is a gaming keyboard, if you can't already tell. Jump, like all these extra, extra, and they don't make it anymore. So the dudes that played with this and theirs broke and they have to have that keyboard because that's what their muscle memory is trained for. That's how they play their League of Legends or their Counter-Strike the best. They're gonna pay $120 for this. Their store number three. We did not just find the Logo 7 Dolphin exclusive. Super sick, we're gonna grab this, $8.99. We're also gonna grab a DVD VHS combo, $12.99. Sony. So who's battling? You and, okay, you and Ryan are battling, okay. That <laughs> Rakin pops in and says that's gonna be a good battle. All right, just got off conference call with Chris, Steve, and Jason. Got some notes about the green room. Uh, Chris wrote a guide called Boots to Bucks. That's gonna come into the site. We've been doing this thing called Thrift Battle on a, a YouTube Live, and he wants to do a soundboard so he could do like a fatality, fatality. sound or like, KO or something. So I'm gonna try to figure out how to do YouTube live soundboards. And uh, we wanna do a poll, like people are supposed to be voting who has the better item. So some sort of like poll or comment counter on live. So I gotta figure out some of those things within the next couple days before I take off. So I picked up the toner at about 2.30 today. I listed it as soon as I got home, which was about four o'clock. And at about five o'clock it sold. So you do the math. It sold for $85, 
Bought it for 10, sold it for 85. So after fees and shipping and everything, I'll have made like 60 bucks for what little work I did today. So basically I freeloaded off of that thrift store pretty hard. After further research, this is the Merc Stealth, or the Merc Stealth Backlit Gaming Keyboard, model KUH0702. This is a fantastic keyboard. We have presets, we got tons of functions, we got a whole entire gaming set over here with macros and micros, multiple colors, and illumination strengths. $5.99 from Goodwill, and they're selling on eBay. All of them have sold. One at auction for $76, and the other ones are for over $100 all day, every day. Currently, there are none listed so I will have the only listing. Let's command it for 150. I already tested it, super easy to test. You just plug it in, it works perfectly fine. I was also testing a DVD VHS over there and we're going to test bad boy real quick for continuity. So this will sell for 30, this will sell for 120 to 150 and that will sell for 100 over there. I completely forgot today was Tuesday so there's no Q&A Tuesday. Q&A Tuesday is gonna have to be on Wednesday, released on Thursday. I actually worked on the car a lot today. I didn't film a lot of it because it takes me a lot longer to work on it when I'm filming. The engine wrote, ran another code, which was something for the throttle positioning sensor. I pulled that off, repositioned it, and now it's driving fine again. I'll probably take it up on the highway to Northport tomorrow. I need to get a workout in. I haven't worked out in over a week. I'm going to be cutting down to a three-day workout for the part-time van life and when I go out to California because I'm not going to be working out consistently five days a week. But right now it's looking like I'm going to be going leaving on Sunday or Monday. I'm uh, expecting to meet up with the Rally Roots on Friday or Saturday. I think we're gonna go yard sailing or something. It'll be fun before I get out of here. Kickball will be probably when I get back in December. It was a pretty short video, but you did get to see some cool thrift finds. If you haven't already, give the video a thumbs up. If you have any encouraging comments, I'd love to hear them. If you have any Q&A Tuesday on Wednesday, released on Thursday uh, questions, uh, I'll be more than happy to answer them tomorrow, and I will talk to you guys then. Bye. Just found a lawnmower in the trash at this person's house. We're gonna throw this in the van, see if we can fix it tomorrow.